um, Fangham, there's anything about being a musician that's helped you be a politician particularly? Oh, yeah, totally. Absolutely. 100%. Uh, first of all, learning how to perform. Um, and I think that's it's incredibly helpful to be able to read your audience. And also somebody the other day, I made a speech and somebody texted me saying, your speech has got such a lilting rhythmic quality. And I said, honestly, I think it's because I'm a musician. Because I do think that you have a better sense of rhythm just in general for having learned to play and I when I read my speeches before I if I get it right I write my speeches I rewrite them I read it out loud and it's only when you read it out loud that you think oh no that the rhythm of that's wrong and so definitely 100% but the performing thing I think really helps because I'm not nervous of, a, of an audience um, yeah. uh, other than that a nice way that you get sometimes before a concert when you're just sort of excited nervous I sometimes get that what about you Emily do you think there's definite transferable skills Totally agree because I was I got I was so used to performing in public mm. like playing solos or in groups that when I started to have to make speeches it was just the same and I didn't have to worry about playing the wrong notes so it was kind of easier. <laughs> That's uh, true. <laughs> I didn't have to worry about bowing all the notes or being in tune so it's actually I think a little easier uh, and yeah it just you, you just have to get comfortable and also the thing about music and all of you guys will know you meet so many people doing it that in politics your job is about meeting so many people that you're just used to meeting I, I just was used to meeting those people at courses and just you name it so yeah it was it's unbelievably helpful I think there's another way in which my own personal experiences was helpful which was when I was a young musician uh, that's way back in the 1970s and the early 1980s um, I was often the only non-white young musician in the room and my dad who was is, was Indian and he came from India he was almost always the only non-white musician in like any sort of ensemble that he played in and that in some ways in, in a rather sad way was good preparation for being in politics now I'm pleased to say I think music's changed a lot and I'm really glad but it definitely was in, in some ways it was good preparation for me to learn that that was only ever someone else's problem it was that didn't have to be my problem um, and I'm quite proud of the fact that I, I haven't let it be a problem but it has it, it's, it is notable that um, politics is still quite a male um, and uh, white um, profession uh, there's nothing wrong with being male and white but I think it's good if there's a more of a diversity so there was a bit of preparation for there 